Summit Carbon Solutions approached their Elton Ethanol a couple years ago with the idea of putting in a pipeline to sequester our CO2 off of our facility. Knowing the leadership of Summit Carbon Solutions, we figured it was a win-win situation. I think this was a perfect fit for Theraldson Ethanol. The leaders here have been trying to figure out a way to sequester carbon, to lower the CI score, to be able to hit the LCFS markets. Summit Carbon Solutions was a perfect answer. Low carbon fuel standard is a market that has developed to allow plants to sell into that market that have low carbon intensity scores. By us putting in the Summit Carbon Solutions, that is going to allow us to decrease our CI score by roughly 30 to 35 points. The lower a plant can get, the better market opportunities that that plant's gonna have to be able to get into these markets. And again, I think over the next five to 10 years, you're gonna see more states developing and adopting that market, which is going to allow us to have better, better opportunities. Uh, to sell our ethanol at a premium. If there's a demand for it, that value goes up. If we win, the farmer wins. Seeing the tax credits available for Theraldson Ethanol, seeing how Summit was taking care of some of the landowners the, that the pipeline was going across their land, and for the plant itself and being able to reach other ethanol markets, makes it more sustainable for the plant and for the farmer with land values, price of corn, accessibility to this market. This is not just making Theraldson and Summit money. The farmers themselves and the landowners, uh, they're going to gain benefit from us being here for them and having a good corn price for them in the future. Summit has really stepped up and has taken care of discussing with landowners that if anything disruptive happens to their land, they're always going to be by their side and repairing anything that could possibly happen as long as that pipeline is in service. For what they're getting to uh, disrupt that land and the payback that they're getting over a certain amount of years is definitely worth it. I think that landowner within the first year or two would definitely be able to start working that land again. There's change every day and I think we need to you know be open-minded on what we're trying to do on making the environment a much cleaner and, and healthier place to live and continue to grow our industry just like anybody would be supportive on growing their own industry.